Hey everybody, I'm First Alert Meteorologist Brian Walder. We could have a chance to maybe luck into seeing the northern lights tonight. Now, it's usually the case here, it's going to be on the horizon or maybe with the help of a camera or a phone. Best view of conditions will be off to our north, but a similar setup in terms of the lights forecast tonight and tomorrow night. Best chances will be, be between, say, dinner time and midnight. In terms of weather, tonight be, might be the better of the two nights. As we're looking at mainly clear skies early with increasing clouds late. Wake up temperatures in the morning will be in the 50s. Highs tomorrow, generally in the mid to upper 70s. We could see a couple of morning showers as the cold front slides through. Otherwise, a little breezy for the day tomorrow. There's future cast 8 o'clock in the morning. A couple showers possible. This might be a little bit overdone on our forecast model, but it's a rain chance. It's a lot more than we've had lately, and it could be our only chance of rain in the extended forecast. Note by lunchtime, the showers are gone. Could see some clouds linger into the second half of the day tomorrow, but we should be good to go for high school football games tomorrow evening, and sunshine does return to the forecast on Saturday. We're warming up on Saturday back into the mid 80s. We'll stay warm for this time of year, looking at early next week. But some days will be warmer than others. Low 70s there by Monday, but could reach the mid to upper 70s once again by the middle and end of next week. And overall, despite those up and down temperatures, we'll see very similar weather with lots of sunshine and the dry conditions continuing. Over well, that full 10 day forecast and 25 news this evening, get your forecast online anytime at 25newsnow.com and on our 25 News First Alert weather app.